Hey y'all, welcome back to my channel. It's me, Stevie Marie, AKA Curly Curvy and Fit. And today I will be showing you how I created this gorgeous braid out using Curl Theory's leave-in conditioner and their multi-style cream. This video is sponsored, but as you know, all opinions are my own. But before we get into this tutorial, if you're new, welcome to the family and don't forget to hit that subscribe button. And if you're not new, welcome back. I need my old and new YouTube family members to hit that notification bell so that you know when I upload a brand new YouTube video. So let's get into this tutorial. So first, I'm starting off on a freshly washed hair and we are going to separate my hair into four sections. First, we are going to spray this section of hair with water because it is recommended that we use these styling products on wet hair. The first product I am going to use is Curl Theory's Leave-In Conditioner. I am using this as my moisture base. I love this leave-in because it contains aloe vera and castor oil to make the hair soft and manageable. As you can see, it's also a great tool for detangling the hair before I style it. Now I am separating my hair into an even smaller piece to get ready to braid this section. Now I'm going in with their multi-style cream. As you can see, this multi-styler cream is nice, thick, and creamy. I chose to use this for my braid out because you can use this for styles where you will want to get that bomb definition. And that's exactly what I'm going for. If you want additional hold and shine, you can apply their gel styler. But my hair does great with just the cream. You can see that my hair is loving this cream because the curls are already clumping. Now that we have applied the leave-in and the multi-style cream, this section of hair is complete. And now, as you can see, I am going ahead and braiding this section of hair. The key to making sure that your ends are curly when you go to take down the braid out is to make sure you brush the ends of your hair and then finger coil it around your finger. So my hair is done. I've installed the braids throughout my hair. And now all I really did was wait for the braids to fully dry. So hopefully that is tomorrow. I'm gonna let it air dry, get some of this excess product off my hair, and then I'll probably sit under the dryer for about an hour just to make sure that my hair is fully dry for tomorrow when I take this down. So it is the next day, and surprisingly, my hair dried in one day. These are the results of what my hair looks like fully dry. And now we are going to go in with Curl Theory's oil. And I love to apply oil to my hair before I go in to undo the braid out. When you go to unravel your braid out, you want to make sure that you start at the ends of the braid. And you want to make sure that you take your time so that you still have the three sections of the braid intact. I just sped this clip up just for the sake of time, but please believe me, I took my time when taking these braids down. So now this is what my hair looks like after I have unraveled the braids. This beautiful definition is there. Now I am going to separate these parts into even smaller parts so that I can get the volume that I love. If you don't want volume on first day hair, that's okay. You can wear your hair just like this and then separate your hair when you want to, but I'm just gonna go ahead and separate these parts, these braid out parts into even smaller sections. When I go to separate my hair into even smaller sections, I make sure to start at the root this time to feel where my hair naturally separates. And that's where I separate my hair into the smaller section. 
I also make sure to finger coil the ends and that's where you'll get the little curl towards the end of the braid out. This is the side where I already separated my hair into smaller sections and here you can see the difference between the two sides. Now for even more volume, grab that pick and just start picking your roots. Emphasis on the roots. You want to make sure that you only pick your roots so that you do not mess up the definition of the braid out. So these are the results of the braid out. As you can see, my hair looks very moisturized and it came out so defined. If you want to purchase the products I used in this video, please check out the links in my bio. Also, if you're wondering what products would work for your hair, please check out the Help Me Decide page on Curl Theory's website. Thank you so much for tuning in. Bye.